guys, it's Jodie and welcome to a new video. So today is officially day two of a book mess. So if you missed day one, then make sure you go and check that out. But in this video, we're gonna be decorating my library room for Christmas and I'm so excited. I love Christmas as you guys all know and decorating for Christmas is just such a fun thing and I am very very lucky to have my very own library and decorating for Christmas is always something I enjoy so yes I'm very, very excited to do that today and thought I would film this little video and bring you guys along with me as I do that. So I did film one of these videos last year so I will link that in the description box down below if you do want to go and check that out. It will be quite similar to this year's. Very, very excited to put my little tree up but first things first I'm going to go make a hot chocolate. It's a must. Whenever you're decorating for Christmas, putting a Christmas tree up, you have to have a hot chocolate to go along with it. So we're going to go make a hot chocolate and then we're going to come up and get started. So go and grab yourselves a hot drink and a nice cosy blanket and get ready to feel festive and watch this video. <laughs> I do believe it's Christmas It's cold outside but I'm warm within Cause Christmas time is here Okay, so I've got my hot chocolate and I think the first thing I'm going to do is to organise everything and get it all sorted, see what I've got. I do need to buy a few more things, so I think I'm going to need to buy more lights because I seem to have lost loads of Christmas lights. And I also want to buy some new stockings to hang on my bookshelves and like little bits like that. So yeah, if I don't end up doing that and showing that in this video, you'll see it in like an upcoming vlog or something. So yeah, anyways, let's just get everything out and then we'll put the tree up and I'm so excited. But not looking forward to fighting Frankie because I don't know what the science is <laughs> between cats and Christmas trees. But I'm telling you now, a cat's brain chemistry is 100% altered as soon as its eyes see a Christmas tree. What is it about Christmas trees that just gets them so riled? I would love to know. But anyways, I'm going to make a start and I'm really excited. I lost track of time. Okay, so this is like the basics of what I've got to deal with for the Christmas have some like little bits that I've had for years that I'll put on the shelves um so yeah there's like some signs and stuff and then these are like the other little ornaments I've got to decorate the tree so I think I'm going to put the tree here again like I did last year but I was debating putting it in the window hi Frankie <laughs> but I don't know like I just don't know whether to put it here where this table is whether to put the chair in this corner and the tree there I don't know I'm going to put it up here first and see what it looks like and then I might move it around a bit Frankie I know is going to attack me any second as soon as I get this out of the box but yeah let's just try and at least set up the tree for now So the tree is up, kind of looking a little bit 
sparse. I do hate this tray and I definitely want to replace it soon. Um, oh, and here we go. That did not take long, did it? Oh, Frankie. <laughs> You're going to fall. <laughs> Frankie, no. Frankie. Frankie. What is it with cats and trees? But yes, I've put the tree up so I'm gonna put the lights on now I don't think I'll have enough so I will have to buy more and um, but we'll put the lights on and we'll see how it's looking ah 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 Frankie no okay hey guys so let me just get this sander hat off I just got done filming a video but I did get some lights today so I can finish filming this video now and finish decorating my library room and the Christmas tree. So I'm gonna do the lights now and then we're gonna finally finish decorating the tree. So yay. Um, but yes, anyways, bye. <laughs> Lights are on the tree. It's time to decorate and put all the bubbles on and I'm excited. Thing 
think I remember me being with you Was that just a dream that never came true? I am sitting here sinking drink after drink as I do this time of the year Thought I was trying to forget you I must have forgotten I am lost in my memories Pouring the hours away Say, do you Okay, so it's finally dawn and I'm so tired but it looks so cute so I will quickly show you guys what it looks like so here is the Christmas tree so I've crammed as much as I possibly can on here because it's such a, like an empty tree like it's so sparse I've filled it with as many like baubles and decorations as I can and it looks so cute lots of these decorations I've had for years since I was very young and I got my very first Christmas tree in my room um, so like these are very very old and also like these are kind of oldish and this one with my name on um, I have my little fairy that my manager at work got me which I adore so cute and I love these bubbles these are from the pound store last year and I wish I'd got more and I love these as well um, so yeah I have some like different ones from book boxes on here um, this cute little car and just like lots of random decorations but i just love it like it's so cute and chaotic <laughs> so yeah this is what the christmas tree ended up looking like very cute and then i put this little merry christmas sign here and this like little thing just to make it look a little bit more festive and i do feel like that looks quite cute there um and then down here so we'll ignore all the wires on the floor and the fairy lights i need to get rid of um, so I've put my little Christmas coaster out with my initial on it, my Christmas bookmark. I have another one of these, but it's in a book at the moment. This is from my friend Leora's store, which is Mine Daisies on Etsy. So you can get lots of different festive bookmarks from her Etsy store, and they're so cute. And then I have this, which is like my little countdown to Christmas. We have this gorgeous little candle um i got a couple years ago. So it says Happy Holidays on it, which I feel is very appropriate for me, and it's just really really cute. Um, so yeah, I have that there. I have these hardcover Christmas books, so just some random ones just to decorate it a little bit more. I have my Merry Christmas sign and my Santa hat. And then this is like my Christmas shelf, so I have lots of like Christmas reads on here. The little Santa thing and little fake Santa book thing, which is really, really cute. And then on my desk, I've put this little tree. I've had this since I was a kid. It's so old now. So that's that, which is cute. I have this little light up house and I have this candle that says Merry Bookmas. And then my water bottle with Santa's on, which is from TK Maxx. Then here we have this random stocking. Again, it is also very old. And this Santa I've had since I was a child. You put like a little candle in the back of it. Um, and yeah, I love this. It's very sentimental because I've had it for so long, but it looks cute there. Then here we have this little Christmas stand and some more like of whatever this is called. And then I put this Merry Xmas sign on here. I usually have this on my white shelves, but I feel like it does look better on the black shelves. I don't know. I just kind of look how this looks. It's not too much, but it's still festive. So I feel like it's quite cute. Um, but yeah, that is everything for my festive decorate the library for Christmas with me. Um, I'm probably going to buy a few more bits to put in here. I just can't really find anything I like in the shops at the moment. I want to get a nice big festive pillow for my reading chair and maybe another festive blanket. I wanna get some more stockings to go on here and something else. Um, so yeah, I'll probably just add to this throughout December, but I love how it looks. I love having my Christmas tree up again. I might move the tree in the window and have my reading chair here. I'll probably play about with it, but for now I'm leaving it like this and I think it looks really, really cute. So yes, I hope you guys did enjoy this cute little decorate my library for Christmas video. 
I don't think it's as good as last year's but I had to pop out to get lights during this one and I film it in the dark everything's just a bit chaotic but I hope you guys still enjoyed it anyway I just love having a Christmas tree in here it's so cute and cozy and I'm so excited for so many cozy festive evenings in this room and I'm very very lucky to have this room I do know that but yeah I hope you guys did enjoy this welcome to a day two of bookmas I hope that you stick around for all of my upcoming bookmas videos and if you did miss it you can watch my first bookmas video which is my December TBR I'll have that linked up here but yes let me know down below if you already have your Christmas tree up and if you have a Christmas tree in your room or what theme you usually go for do you have a bookish themed Christmas tree I really want to do that I want to try and get some bookish ornaments one year but yes let me know down below in the description box leave a Christmas tree emoji in the comments if you made it to the end of this video and don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you did enjoy it I really do appreciate it anything I've mentioned on my previous bookmas videos will be linked in the description box down below along with a link to a last year's decorate my library for Christmas video and the link to my patreon and that is where you'll find extra content from me such as a monthly reading vlogs we do a monthly buddy read a monthly readathon live shows a discord and lots of other things it's all over on my patreon so if you are interested in any of that then check out the description box but yes thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you're all safe and well i hope you're reading lots of good books and i'll see you in the next one bye